Hi, I'm Don Carr, and this is the Two Notes Torpedo Captor X. The Captor X is a stage, studio, and home tool for your favorite tube amp. It's a reactive load box, attenuator, virtual mic, speaker cabinet simulator, IR loader, post amp processor, headphone amp, DI, oh and it's stereo, and MIDI, and Bluetooth, and it's this big. From the speaker output of your amp, you plug in here to the red input. Inside there's a reactive load box designed to handle 8 ohms and up to 100 watts RMS. There's a uh, two position input selector on the front that lets you set the level coming in based on your amp's output. From there, you can connect the speaker cabinet here and there's a three position output selector that independently controls the output to the speaker cabinet. The settings are quiet, half volume, and full volume. And if you don't want to use the speaker cabinet at all, just don't plug a cable in and the internal reactive load takes over the job of handling your amp's output. I mentioned that the internal load box is reactive, that's as opposed to a static load. Basically a reactive load responds to the different input signals that you give playing guitar, chords, single notes, loud, soft, high, low, more like how a speaker responds so the sound and feel from your amp is the same, just quieter or silent. There's also a pair of XLR outputs, a nice addition on a unit this size, with a ground lift. There's a USB out for controlling the Torpedo remote app on your computer and a MIDI connection for either patch changing or controlling any parameter. Whoa. Here's where you plug in the power supply, which is included. On the front panel, there's an output control for the DIs and the headphones, which plug in here. Headphones sound awesome, by the way. Next to that is the aforementioned input level switch, and above that is a voicing control. Now, this is really handy. It's a global EQ of sorts. With the control at 12, it's neutral. To the left, enhances mid-range frequencies, and to the right, scoops mids. Great for a quick fix, especially if you're using it in a live performance. You know, for example, if the room is boomy sounding and you need a bit more mids overall so your guitar doesn't get lost in the mix, this control will keep you from having to change every preset. presets you have instant access to six of them on the front panel. Again great in the heat of battle so you can change sounds quickly and without using the Torpedo Remote app. It can be any six you like. Finally the space control can adjust either the width of the reverb or the tightness of the double tracker. More info on that later. Let's get into the Torpedo Remote app. This is where it gets really interesting. Captor X comes loaded with 32 different cabinets, 8 mics, and 8 different room environments. You can use two different mics at a time, adjust the levels individually, and change the axis and distance from the speaker, virtually of course. You can also move the mic to the back of the cabinet, change the phase, mute, or bypass, which sends an unprocessed signal. There's also a noise gate, which is variable and assignable per preset. I'm connected via Bluetooth on an iPad and there's also an Android app. The Mac or Windows version connects through the USB port. I could definitely see hooking up a computer if I was doing a lot of editing and preset creating, but I really like the convenience of the app. For the whole demo, I'm using a PRS 513 and a Mesa Boogie TC50. <laughs>
There's an EQ with three different settings, each with their own frequency options, guitar, bass, and custom. Then there's an enhancer. It affects lows, mids, and highs, but in a broader sense. It also has a dry, wet control so you can blend in the unenhanced signal. It has a guitar bass option which are voiced differently as well. Reverb is killer and offers all of the standard option you'd want, from tight to cavernous, funky to pristine, a very nice addition. There are three output options. You've got stereo, dual mono, and wet dry. In stereo, you have the option of the twin tracker, which is more than a delay or doubler. Think of it as a second guitar copying your playing. The balance controls the level, and the tightness controls the width or how far apart the two sounds are. Now, remember the space control on the front panel? Tightness can be assigned to it. Dual mono mode allows you to process the right and left sides differently. Each side has a level control and the space control can be assigned to either side or both. The right side has its own EQ so you can EQ it differently from the left side. One great use for that would be if you were performing live and sending a separate signal to monitors in front of house. You might want more low end in your monitor mix than front of house and possibly more reverb. You can also use this to make two different sounds and blend them or pan left and right. In wet dry mode, the right side is totally unprocessed directly off your amp. This is good for recording so you can audition and choose different speaker cabinets later in the process. If all of this weren't enough, you can load third party IRs into the Captor X and there are even more virtual cabinets to choose from in the two note store. You'll have to use your computer and connect via the Captor X's USB port to access those. <laughs> Some final thoughts. It's amazing how much tonal variation you can get from one amp and one guitar by changing the rest of the signal chain. Speaker cabinet, mics, room, post-processing. The sonic depth in all of the Captor X's sounds make that even more obvious. 
Two Notes has a long history of products designed to take deeper control of your favorite tube amp, so it's no surprise that the Captor X sounds great, does so much without any fluff, and comes in a totally efficient package. I really appreciate that there are options, but you don't have to dig deep to get going. That's a direct result of Two Notes' experience and knowledge of knowing what works and how to get great guitar tones. Thanks for checking out the Two Notes Torpedo Captor X with me. If you have any questions about this or any other Two Notes product, make sure to contact your Sweetwater sales engineer or you can check us out online at sweetwater.com. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Click here for more videos like these, or start at Sweetwater for all your music instrument and pro audio needs.